Uh, this year, uh, I got a lot of faith in my horse, my partner, and, mm -hmm. and I have high expectations, you know, mm -hmm. as everybody does and should. Wrangler Network is at the Wrangler National Finals Rodeo here in Las Vegas, and we have Trey Yates sat in the hot seat. Team roping legend, I'm just going to go ahead and throw it out there for you. Um, obviously, you've had so much success in the arena. Um, you're back for the finals again this year. How's it feel? Feels really good, yep. Been a couple years, and, and uh, it was a good humbling experience the last couple years, but finally got uh, on board with uh, a good partner, and I'm very blessed and happy to be back. You know, you're roping with Tyler Wade, which is so funny to me because he's obviously known for being quite aggressive. So you got to do your job because T. Wade's always going to go out there guns blazing. So coming into the finals this year, how would you guys get ready? How would you practice? You know, uh, uh, probably a month and a half ago, I went to his house for a couple of days. And then uh, we, we have a pretty good rhythm with our rope. And we've roped a lot of steers together, practiced a lot. You know, not necessarily for this setup. But um, we have a, you know, we've, we get along good. Uh, we have faith in each other. And uh, he came to Arizona to my house for a couple of days before we came out here. And we roped and went to the jackpots. And... Um, I don't know, we, we've prepared uh, where we feel comfortable and hopefully it works out. Yeah, you've obviously, I've known you for a really long time since mm -hmm. we were a little, so it's been fun to watch your career really unfold. But at the Thomas and Mac, it's so much different than just roping in a jackpot. I mean, there's a lot more stress that comes with it. So how do you keep strong mentally? Um, you know, I uh, can't really say. The last time I was here, it was kind of a, I was just kind of for, along for the ride and, yeah. and it worked out. We had some success, but... You know, this year uh, I got a lot of faith in my horse, my partner, and mm -hmm. and I have high expectations, you know, mm -hmm. as everybody does and should. But uh, you know, a lot of variables, a lot of a lot of different things can take place, and just hope that uh, you know we have some success and and uh, just you know the Lord has a plan for all of us, and mm -hmm. and uh, whatever our, whatever's meant to be over the next ten days will be. Mm -hmm. You know, I feel like you have a lot more confidence than the last time we were here together, sitting down. Um, when you were coming in then, you were like, I just don't know what to expect. Um, you didn't want to do the interview parts. You were very nervous. But now it just seems like you're really in your element. Um, how did you adapt? I mean, you've been away for a little while. It's been a couple of years. Yeah. Uh, you know, like I said, the last couple of years, uh, I didn't make the finals. I, I came close. But yeah. uh, the first year, I just... I kind of made it in an instant, Aaron yeah. and I did, and I and, uh, didn't really even know what was going on. Yeah. I never, it was my first year, you know, full-time rodeoing, and and uh, the last couple of years I expected a lot out of myself and uh, maybe thought I was better than I was mm -hmm. and uh, put my nose to the grindstone and tried to get my mind on track was the main thing, and, and this year I set out with a mission to make it, and, and uh, that's what we did, and yeah. we, we had some big wins, and and uh, just very blessed to be in the position we're in, so. You know, it takes a really big person to admit that, that they thought they were bigger than they truly were. And I feel like a lot of people that are coming in this year that have been successful this season have said that. I think last year was humbling for quite a few people. So it is good to see you back. I'm glad that you're healthy. You have a great teammate. I think it's going to be really fun to watch you guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys.